Hey, Len Erickson here with another Purveyor of Light Lightroom Quick Tip. Uh, today we got a really quick and easy one, but uh, you'd be surprised how often you'll uh, use this tip. And, and most people never even know that this, tip, this uh, feature is in Lightroom. Uh, we have so many friends and family that are at different degrees of computer savvy and uh, you know some use Facebook some do not use Facebook uh, a lot of times the only way if we want to share our photos with some of our friends and family uh, is to resort down through email uh, that's about as far as we can get with most people is an email attachment um, so a lot of people find it a real pain to have to go into mail and then attach the photos and and all this rigmarole but all that is built in to Lightroom so it's basically one click and you can turn around and email your photos to your friends and family. Uh, what's great about this Lightroom is it even works with AOL, uh, Gmail, Outlook, uh, Apple Mail. Uh, it supports all of them. So let me show you how to set this up, okay? Now the setting up is only one time. After that, uh, Lightroom will remember what your settings are. And then when you want to email, you just hit email and it will be automatic. So let's go ahead and show you how to set it up. So here I've got some photos and I'll say, oh, I'd like to send these in an email. Maybe these three photos, maybe this one, this one. Uh, I, want it to, I want to send to some friends and family. So I highlight those photos and then I go up to file and then right here, email photos. You'd be surprised how many people have never even noticed that that feature was within Lightroom. So I hit email photos and Lightroom automatically opens up a box to address and then you'll see from the from using which mail client. Now by default on this particular machine uh, I don't have an email client up so it's defaulting to the Apple e email system. Uh, but I'm going to go ahead and set this up from my uh, purveyor of light Gmail account. So I'm going to pull down from here and I'm going to say go to email account manager. Okay, from here, I can set up as one or as many email accounts as I wish to work within Lightroom. So I'm going to hit the Add button here. And then it's going to say, give me a name for this email. And I'm going to call this my Purveyor of Light email. And now I get to choose the service provider. Remember I said that Lightroom supports all the different formats. Of, and uh, I can just simply select Gmail. And hit OK. And I didn't need to know all this technological jum mumble jumbo. Uh, Lightroom already put it all in for me, and I don't have to think past that. So now all I have to do is just put my personal email credentials in here. And again, you only have to do this once. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and type in my purveyor of light uh, email. And I'm going to use the Gmail account, of course. And I have to give it a password. And then the last step I have to do here is come here and hit validate. So we'll go ahead and hit that. And now we have a green light and this email account has been validated. Uh, and that's it. We have set up our Gmail now linked into uh, Lightroom. And you can see that it's just saying, where would you like to send the email to? And uh, I can uh, turn around and select who I'd like to send the email to, uh, address it, the subject. Uh, I could type a little email in here, and then I can go ahead and hit send. Uh, you'll even notice here that I have a choice to select how I want to send the photos. Uh, do I want them small for for quick easy uh, transmission do I want them in a medium size of 500 picks or do I want a large or do I want to send it in the original quality if I want really big files for now I'm gonna say large files I will uh, I'm just gonna go ahead for demonstrations and send them to myself and the subject I'll call photos and here are the photos I promised.
Okay. So there are the three photos. I'm sending them as large. And I just simply hit send. And off they go. Uh, I didn't even have to go to a web browser or open up a client or anything now. Now that we've set this up, anytime I wish to send a, a photo to someone, now I just simply select the photo and I go up to file and I go to email and it automatically remembers my settings and says, who are you sending the email? And I can just quickly fill out the email and hit send. No more configurations, no more leaving applications, uh, no more having to go into other clients to go attach them and find where they are and upload the pictures. All that's taken care of for you and automated within the Lightroom client. Okay? So I hope you found this useful. I hope you have a great day. And uh, if you like videos like this, be sure and uh, leave some comments down below. Uh, be sure and hit the subscribe button so you get notified every week uh, when we release new videos. We wouldn't want you guys to miss any of our uh, weekly videos. So until next week.